Hi everybody, thank you very much for watching my videos. Today I will show you how to do it basically uh, basic tomato sauce. Very simple. If you want to get more sauce, you can use some vegetable. If you don't want to get more sauce, you know, like just for one or two portions, you can use just onion, uh, garlic, and some fresh salsa or some fresh oregano or some fresh basil. Then we have here tomato sauce, tomato puree, and put uh, whole tomato. So th this is what you need. I will use today some carrots because I want to get some little bit more, and the carrots it will give you some sweetness, natural sweetness for this. Because the tomato are a little bit sour, so carrot will give some sweetness. For seasoning, you will need just some salt, and on the end, if you wanna to use some dry basil or dry uh, oregano or if you have fresh herbs I will use today just parsley so step, let's start thank you so carrot is already diced you can dice on any different on any sizes because anyway on the end you will let blitz it the pot is on with some olive oil we're gonna use two garlic loaves and we have the onion already peeled so we will start with a carrot then we will put onion with garlic and then we will put as well some of the parsley so they are sweated now all together and i put add on some uh, some parsley stalks because they have a taste so it will improve and just sweat it and then we will put on the tomatoes tomato puree and just let it so and this time we will put the tomato and this one this is first You can rinse them as well with the water and see. Now I like to use fresh tomato always, but now it's not the season. I don't have the tomato right now. I found a good price as well. And another one. And this way you can do it as well. Soup, you will put some celery sticks, you will put some different vegetable if you like it, and just blend it, cook it and blend it. You can put some fresh thyme, everything. Again, if you want a plain, basic sauce, just for a few portions, like one or two portions, you can use only maybe half onion, one clove of garlic, uh, one tin of the tomato, and just you can put some little bit stock, vegetable stock, or if you or if you don't have it, once you don't have it, you can use just water to get more liquid, or you can use some wine, it's very good, or vodka, or brandy. Everything is about your taste. So just just let reduce now. Let cook it. We will put a little bit more water. I use the water from the springs and just cook it, blitz it and then it's ready. Just season it and take it off. And you can use for pasta, you can use for uh, for dumplings when I was using, for lasagne, for, for vegetable, cannelloni or for anything you, you can use it. That's the main basic tomato. So and this is the tomato sauce. nice red and it tastes nice the consistency is good so everything and everything is up to you how you're gonna use it if you will put some carrots inside if you don't have the carrots if you don't want to use the carrots it's gonna be more reddish so it's everything up to you and as well with this tomato sauce you can do it in advance 
and if you don't eat them all and if you don't eat the whole sauce you can put it in the uh, plastic bag vacuum bag or just plastic bag and try to fold it if they will be flat and freeze them then you can take it out and you can have quick lunch you know like tomato sauce or you can do it tomato sauce with pasta or or some people like it mashed potato so it's everything up to you what you will do it or even dumplings that I do with the recipe here with dumplings and some beef or vegetable everything up to you so thank you very much for watching my videos stay tuned for more videos and please subscribe